Mecca restricted area. For the sequence where Jude Law and Haley are flying through New York City, we have our CG water and we have our CG waterfalls. The uh, building right here, the broken building, is actually a scale miniature, while the building that is crashed into is a uh, computer graphics painting, as are other buildings in the background, and the sky was pieced together from a bunch of uh, pieces. There's a bunch of different things that we had to do. Sometimes the amphibicopter is completely computer generated, like when it's much smaller in frame, or if it has to do some really wacky move, or uh, the amphibicopter might be a live action stage thing that we shot on blue screen, and we took the windshield off of the amphibicopter while we shot it so that we could put in the reflections of whatever buildings they're flying by instead of all the lights and rigs and set on the stage. And we have to add uh, buildings in the background. They might be uh, model buildings, you know, scale models, or we might have computer generated models, or we might have photographs of buildings that we put on little cards and put that in our computer render. Turn around, Joe. Turn all the way around. And we have a uh, water simulation to uh, generate some computer generated oceans that are flowing through all of the streets of New York City. This is some of the uh, concept art that was done for this shot, and this is what the shot's looking like right now. As you can see, we kept a lot of the elements of the concept art, um, the building that's crashed into, all the damage underneath the building, and of course all the water. Having great concept art just really makes things so much easier because you don't have to look, go through a thousand iterations trying to figure out what things are supposed to look like. At the end of the world where the lions weep, here is the place dreams are born. And then we also have this shot uh, a little bit later. They've finally found the building where the, wa where the lions weep. Again, we have our computer-generated uh, water and waterfalls. The Cybertronics building itself is a uh, scale miniature. It's in real life about six feet tall, I think. And the lions that go in front of it are also uh, scale miniatures. And these, this time the buildings in the back are uh, also scale miniatures. And this is what the sky really looked like that day, except there are some power lines in the back that we removed. And we have our computer-generated water with all the currents rolling through and splashes. And these other buildings in the background are scale miniatures as well. 